girls we sent as Uganda and when they come back they have to do what we call follow up and this is part of their follow up so still as we've worked with you the current girls still I pray that as an alumni I'll have to work hand in hand with uh, yes girls in their follow up to ensure that these people maintain clean of the borehole and sure that this good turn project doesn't die because at the end of it all we want these people to be consuming clean water so all i can say that i pledge to work with the uh, yes girls when they come back so that we can follow up on this good turn uh, for me uh, i would also pledge to work with them as the follow-up activity then also another idea could be starting up other projects like identifying places where there are other dirty bore holes and we for continuity of the project much as it's a good turn and it's part of your activities just for this year i think it can continue maybe in other communities you just establish where there is a dirty, a dirty bore hole or a place that needs to be and we still go there as we monitor this one for Kawala. Did you hear? Me? Yes. Okay. Uh, any other question? Mm, I think we are through. <laughs> I'm sorry, I keep asking for other questions. I just want, I don't know. Eh? Okay. Where do I start from? <laughs> okay, how will you help us to do it online? Hello? Online, I'll basically share a post that you'll be making, or I'll also help with creating videos. Yeah. And uh, after the exchange is finished, like we all go back home, like, will you help us to keep the... After the exchange, when the... Yeah. yeah after the exchange, we'll basically just like. monitor. Yes? Yes. Basically, monitoring, and of course, we'll do this with the help of the so chairpersons and leaders around the community. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Thank you so much. We're for your time and patience. You've been taking.